Hello everyone, this is Yamin and welcome to my square and inquiry for beginner. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can select data from a table. So first of all, in order to select all data from the table, we need to set here, select star from our table name, which is employee. So we'll set here employees. And if we now run this, there can see we're able to see all the data from the table. Now let's say you only want to get the employee name and employee ID only those two so how can i do it so in order to do it you just need to show our here select we need to measure our column name so we we'll say here employee underscore id then we need to give a comma here and we also need to get the employee name so we we'll say here employee underscore name so right now if we just run this there you can see we are only able to see the employee id and employee name let's say you want to see the employee name and salary so we just need to keep a comma here then we can say here salary then if we now run there you can see employee name and salary now let's say you only want to see that employee whose salary is higher than 300 dollar higher than or equal to 300 dollars so for it they are when we say select let me just say here start from employee so here you can see we are able to see all data so here we are going to use a condition so in order to write a condition, we need to write here for then we want the employee data where the salary is higher than 300. So we can say here salary is greater than 300 like this. And if we now run this, there you can see we are able to see the salary 600 and 300.25. Now let's say we also want to see the salary. 300 as well so for it we need to give a equal sign after the is greater than sign so right now if we now run this there you can see we are also able to see the salary in 300 as well so let's say we only want to see for the salaries 100 dollars so we just need to say one here salary equal to 100 sunny okay there is no 100 salary i think it was 100.25 let me just run it and there you can see the salary is 100.25 you can do this also for employee id or employee name let's say here for employee underscore name equal to it will be uh, we also have yamin so let's say here we we'll give two double quotation and here we we'll say yamin and if we now run this there you can see we are able to see the employee name yamin at this data you can do the same for the higher net as well okay let me just we move this let me run it and here you can see we have had date 2019 and okay let's say we want to see the employee whose hard date is higher than 2024 so for it we need to say here higher higher underscore date is greater than or equal to let's say 2024 0 1 0 and we need to keep it in, inside to double border shell since this is a date so right now if we just run this there you can see their higher date is is greater than 2024 there you can see 2025 2024 and 2026 now let's say you also can get the null data here if i want to change the null data so here you can see for this id6 the salary and hard date is null so you can say here where salary is null you can say it like this as well so it will only show the data for this of so yeah so now run this there you can see the salary is null for this that's why it is showing us this square so those are all the basics of how you can select data from a database table i hope this was easy for you thank you very much for watching make sure to subscribe and i hope to see you in the future tutorials